that we just happened across this Bushirabana gold mill ruins. It's like this fortress just out in the desert. We're going in? Oh, there's somebody taking a picture up there? Yeah. <laughs> wow, what is this place? Interesting, I hadn't, I've never heard of this place. I knew that it was a thing. Wow, yeah. Interesting. Don't you love how there's just like no information about what this place is or what it was or what they did? There's just, it just says the name. It's like, please respect the ruins. What? <laughs> there, so obviously this was something. This is where we decide we're going to climb up. I suppose so. pretty high. Let's go up there. So there's an overlook. Don't fall out that window, right? I know. You can wow. see a long ways out there. Yeah, you can. Very cool. There's nothing to see. Just ocean. So interesting. There's all these lookout spots and everything. We're just at the top of this wall here. You can see how they stacked it all up. But uh, there's not much, not much left now. Some craftsmanship when it's Look at some hard back breaking sweaty work to lug all these giant rocks up. Don't fall. I know. I'm like. <laughs> Don't lose your balance up here, girl. We're gonna have to Google it and see what this place was. <laughs> so maybe when we get it's back. It's a complete mystery. I haven't even heard anybody talk about it. See, look at this little guy running around. Definitely fascinating to come and take a look. We'll have to research this out and then we'll appreciate it later when we actually know what it was. Exactly. Right now, it's, it is cool though. We've come to the end of the road, Carl. Well, we just came up on this place and it's, there's just like a whole building there that says Natural Bridge. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm filming and sneezing at the same time. Okay, here. so we have this beautiful building, Natural Bridge, but I think it collapsed. I think the bridge was right there. Yeah, like all this. And this was used to be an archway that has since fallen in. It's I wonder sad. how long ago it caved in. I don't know. That's sad. I bet the first day they came out here and noticed that it had fallen, they were just like, oh, oh just no. heartbroken. Wrong. We're dead wrong. There is the archway. <laughs> this is the bridge right here. Look at that. Wow. There's just a giant natural land bridge going across the ocean right there. And there's Ginger. She's walking across it. You're on top of it right now. You're on the arch right now. There's a lot of garbage floating around down there. That's kind of sad. It just goes to show how much we know about this place, right? <laughs> we're just improvising and going wherever. And uh, we're like, oh, that one's, it's all, it's collapsed. That's a sad day. No, it's just, it's right there. It's okay. There's the arch and there's a giant fissure in the ground right here. I don't know how I'm not supposed to be freaked out by this right now, walking out on this. Holy crap. That's a little bit freaky, I'm not gonna lie. Danger, stay behind the poles. I guess so. You would not want to fall off of this thing. There are no poles, that's the problem. It says stay behind the poles, but there's no poles. You could just walk up and fall in. I don't think we're supposed to be out next to this edge, Ginger. We're not. There's signs everywhere. There's signs everywhere saying we shouldn't be this far out. Carl, quit breaking the roof. Well, and it's weird that there's like big cracks and we're standing out on this archway thing. It would be an adventurous way to go, wouldn't it? Uh, 
I don't know, signs like this everywhere. We walked from over there this way, and then when you get on the, up to the sign, you realize you're on the wrong side of it. Oh, I'm not supposed to be over here. Whoops. <laughs> I honestly thought we were just gonna go on this drive through the desert and maybe pull off and see some stuff. Surprise! There's like, surprise, ancient ruins uh, to defend against pirates, the natural bridge archways, oh, yeah, you didn't body know. surfing you in the about, ocean. No. About the fortress? No. It's to protect. Aruba's like treasures from pirates long long ago. Yeah, That's like pirates would come and raid the island So they built that fort to defend against the pirates. Very cool. Maybe it worked, but it is in shambles Maybe it didn't. <laughs> I, I think know. it's just outdated, babe. So we started like here Like right here this morning We've driven all the way up all the way around the lighthouse all the way down Went up to the chapel went down here. This is where we swam and time-lapse up here is where we flew the drone. I flew the drone here as well. This is where the the gold yeah. smelter ruins are. Um, there's an ostrich farm? That's cool. Anyway, this is the natural bridge ruins where we're standing right now. And then supposedly when we come up here, we're going to be entering the Arakok National Park. And there's a natural pool, uh, sand dunes, I don't know. Fountain Caves Ancient Indian Markings. I don't know, I guess we'll uh, decide where we go. It's an adventure. My sister-in-law warned us when we're driving around in Aruba to beware of the streetwise goats. And lo and behold, there are streetwise goats. Are you approaching the streetwise goats? I think they're gonna run from me. <laughs> are they just like wild goats wandering around the island? Be careful. They won't let me touch them. You want to pet the goats? Woo. Stink. 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 Goats everywhere! Goats here, goats there, this everywhere! Is, look, this is where we're staying. Watch out for the street boys, goats! <laughs> <laughs> ah! We're back at our favorite spot on the beach. Ginger's getting ready to go snorkeling and so am I. There's a party boat. We thought about going on a party boat, but they're just playing music the whole time. We wouldn't be able to film hardly anything anyways without cutting the audio out. And the party boat just comes out here and lets everybody snorkel right where we've been snorkeling for free on the beach anyways. We're gonna go try and see the octopus and the eel again and see if they're still there. But this time we'll be able to get a really up close look at them. Hopefully they don't attack us. <laughs>
little fish. Little fish. Oh. And look at the squid. chill and relax now this vacation has been totally worth it we're uh we haven't been vlogging a whole lot the last couple of days we've actually just made it a real vacation right it's been awesome. tried to get the most out of it that we could and just slept a lot and floated around in the pool we've been snorkeling a lot just going out to eat for dinner and all that fun stuff this is going to conclude the rest of our trip to Aruba unless there's any cool stuff that we see out there in the water or any crabs or fun stuff running around on the beach. Um, I think that's going to be it. We're going to be flying home tomorrow and I'm really excited to see the kids and uh, get back home. I think I feel refreshed and ready to do that.